We're back on track. It's time for the men's 400 metres, and that is the world indoor champion for Trinidad and Tobago, Jareem Richards, who's also part of the Noah Lyles training group in Florida as well, reaping the benefits of that. Of course, has traditionally down the years been a 200 metre round, really, but has been extending himself to 400 metres. When you can extend yourself to your second best event and win the world indoor title, it's not a bad way to go, is it? He's up against Vernon Norwood on his inside. Noah Williams is on the outside, by the way who's the number five all-time indoors over this distance. Alex Haydock-Wilson of Great Britain is on the inside of Norwood in three. And Javon Francis right on the inside for Jamaica. But a season debut for Jareem Richards, who won this race last year. Been training with the likes of Wade Van Niekerk as well in that training group in Florida. Men's 400 metres, two laps of the indoor track. Well, Haydock Wilson of Great Britain Hold it has a run under his belt, a 47-2 run in Karlsruhe on the first leg of the World Indoor Tour. But Jareem Richards already out very well in lane five and right up on the shoulder of Noah Williams outside him as they scramble, as they always do, coming into the home straight to the break and to get the curb. Haydock Wilson trying to make up that ground on the inside, but Richards comes serenely across with a little look in his left wing mirror. Ahead of Norwood, ahead of Williams, Haydock Wilson, and then comes Francis. So 21-17 through halfway for Jareem Richards, whose personal best of 45 flat goes back to his win in Belgrade in the World Indoor Championships as Norwood gathers himself for a challenge. These two finished one and two in this event last year in Staten Island. Richards now being challenged by Norwood. Noah Williams trying to streak through. Norwood might have the streak right on the inside. It might have been Noah Williams coming through. That's very tight indeed. Norwood looked like he was going to get there. Then he didn't. Did Williams sneak through on the inside? Well, Williams thinks that he did, and there we go. That is the confirmation, 45.88, the winning time. He rounded down for two hundredths of a second. Watch this again. Williams, there was space there, wasn't there? Richards is working so, so hard. Oh, all three of them almost broke the tape at the same time. I'm not sure that's the best angle. We might, we'll get the photo, I'm sure, at some point. But even from there, it didn't look like Williams had quite got there, did it? Norwood, with about five paces to go, Norwood looked the most likely, didn't he? He did, but it was Williams who had that momentum. You could see Richard's legs bottling, that were buckling that last 50 metres or so. But that was a good win there for Noah Williams. He was the NCAA indoor champion a couple of years ago. Actually fifth all time over 400 metres indoors. So a very, very impressive start to the season for him. Yeah, he's one of only 11 men who've gone sub 45 indoors. PB for Alex Haydock-Wilson there, 46-29. Uh, That's taken nearly half a second, or sorry, three-tenths of a second off.